All right, what's going on, everybody? It's Mark Jones. Um, so I've decided that the Miage is never going to be exactly a clean car. You know, paint chipping, rust, all this crap, window seal missing. Uh, well, it's it's locked, but it you know it's gutted. It's got rust. It's got a hole in the floor right there. See inside the car. It's it's not a clean car. So uh, first, let me. So what I decided to do is I'm going to put a, a license plate spoiler on the back. I was originally going to buy an actual like $200 official spoiler, but this car doesn't deserve that. It's going to look cool for a, a wacky car, so. Let's get into it. All right, so uh, what I'm thinking about doing is just getting the plates like this, laying them across here, and just getting electrical tape and just holding them to it. So this is basically what I'm doing. I'm um, just taping it on there. I'm just going to drill straight through here and hope for the best. But um, I'm going to get these other license plates on real quick, and then... I will come back and show you them all taped up before I start drilling. Alright, so I got them all taped on. Um, so you can tell what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to go like right off the body right here on both ends. And basically, you can see how much they're hanging over. Right where this body curves up, they're going to bend up. So it's just going to be a little, just a, a small spoiler. Um, so yeah, I'm gonna, they're all taped up right now, they're kind of a little loose, but it's the way she goes. Next I'm gonna drill it, and hope I don't screw anything up. The moment of truth, hope for the best. I'm gonna do this rivet by rivet. Once I get one in, I'm just gonna rivet it in. It's a little too big. Okay. Alright, there we go. Rivet this bad boy in. many more to go but let's go it's actually really solid I'm gonna get a new battery for the camera real quick it's about to run out and then we'll get back at it all right so I got the new battery in um, I got Kip right here 
Um, now time to drill into these plates downwards right here and then rivet them together that way they don't flop around a bunch and this better is almost dead too <sighs> i guess i forgot to recharge it i'll be right back again you know after filming all of that footage i realized that my hair was sticking out like this the entire time but um you know that's just kind of part of this channel now i guess time to finally drill into this and then we'll get some more riveting to put them together so they don't flop around okay right here should be good enough you know what I should probably bend this up before I drill more holes into it because they're not gonna all align whenever they're all bent up All right, well, okay, we're gonna bend this up now, mold it into the shape we want. All right, you know, that's that's good enough. That's about as, that's about as good as it's gonna get. Yeah, that's about as good as it's gonna get. Now time to drill again. Here's a, here's a close-up of how rivets work. Okay, so you saw the other side where I just stick this thing on and start to crimp it off. But watch this side. So you see it's bending in. Oh, geez, I only had the camera down. You see it's bending in like this. It's kind of neat. go so it's basically how a rivet, rivet works and then you can just chop off this little end which I'm going to try and do right now All right, so I got it all riveted up. I put um, electrical tape on the edges so that way no one can get cut on it and sue me. Um, I need to fix, fix some of it. Hold up. Ah, Jesus. Actually, let me just peel that. Let me just put another piece of electrical tape on because that piece is ugly. All right, so I got it back together. Um, put a couple more rivets from the plates to the trunk, just to get a bit, a little bit more stability. Um, put multiple rivets in between the plates and the other plates, like in between each other. So here's the final product. Um, you know, it needs a few little touch-ups here and there, but overall, it's I mean, it's pretty solid, except for the corners. That's pretty loose, but. All this over here is good. Um, I don't mean to toot my own horn, but <laughs> it came out amazing. Uh, so, smash that like button since I did this to my car. You know, I'm gonna I'm gonna make this music video for you qu real quick. Hold up. Now time to check for leaks. Got leaks in that crack. Um, nothing major though. I mean that's why we have... Oh geez, all that water's leaking straight into there. Oh, it's coming out down here though, it looks like. It's not going into the Miata. Alright, that's all that matters. I mean, I don't see any rust. Well, I see rust, but... 
See, there's one of the crimps. We can probably see a few more. There's some in there you can't really see. Um, yeah, I don't spot any. There's the other one. I don't spot any other ones, but. So there you go. If you enjoyed this video, be sure to like and subscribe. Uh, you know, yeah, subscribe for more videos. If you want to follow me, it's on Instagram, Twitter, or Snapchat. It's all under Meowdahuana. I'll see you on the next video. Peace.